this is your commentator, Eddie Moulton. When we all do the evening show for Colum New Year's Heroines Day 3. First off, we're kicking it off with one third of the oldest of column champions, Fukase taking on one half of the goddesses of column champions, Choo Choo. Following contest is your opening match set for one fall. Introducing first, representing M L G from Kobe, Japan. She is one third of the artist of color champions. Who? Kaze! Hey all ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna have incredible matches for you all here tonight. In the evening show for Cardam. And now, introducing her opponent, representing the Bunny Club from Japan. She is one half of the goddesses of Cardam. Champions Choo Choo We've got a lot of champions clashing with each other here in tonight's event. First, we're kicking it off with the one third of the artists of column champions against one half of the goddesses of column champions. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Who now? The Arsh Whip. Carnival tie up. Choo Choo pushed away and hits Fu with a forearm. Went for the knee drop. And a stomp. Counter by Fu. Choo Choo dodged her kick. Oh, and check this out! Tiger Plex. Cover. Oh, no cover! She's going for the on ball. Church is going for the on ball. Go. 
Oh, that's down huge. Juju in control. Oh, went for the knee right in the back of Fu Kasi. Gets a winning arm drag as well. And now the pin. Oh, kick out. Juju's going to move Fu Kasi as she goes for the running knee strike. The eye of Choo Choo. Oh, Choo Choo fights back with a kick to Leg of Foo. She Irish whips out to the corner. There's the bomb. As Choo Choo breaking the arm of Foo went full of stomp as well. Now she's gonna break her. Left arm. Juju with the arm bar locked in. And now, the kick to the section by Fu Kasi. Gives for a strong Irish whip, sending Juju over the top rope. Come on. Oh, it's not a cover. It's a count out. That was a cover. But how can it be a pin if... No, they were fighting outside the ring. Anyways, here comes... Oh, spinning kick blocked by Choo Choo. Full on. Boo. Blocks her kick. Slips the leg. And now goes for the one-legged Boston. Choo Choo, that's the punch to the arm. And now, that's the arm. Fellowed by a... Oh! Foo! Cassie turns it into a bulldog. Dropping down. Choo Choo. And there's the cover. Kick out. Choo Choo's measuring her up. No, oh, it's Fu who is measuring her up for the Venus fly trap. Venus fly trap. Look at Fu go, ladies and gentlemen. And now, the cover. Kick out. Choo Choo kicks the midsection of Boo! Kicks the midsection again! And goes! For the Brain Buster cover! Kick out! She's mashing her up! There it is! Choo Choo submission hole is locked in! Fukase hanging on for dear life. But it's Choo Choo who let go of her submission. Oh no. Going for the on ball now. On ball. And the live bar as well. But the ref calls for the rope break. There goes Fu with the jaw breaker. Close line. Now slamming the back of the head of Choo Choo to the mat. Choo Choo with a punch. She's got Fu. Oh. What is she up to here? She hats the left arm of Fu Kaze. Moves her. Well, the on board. 
Elbow locked in. And on the leg, Boswell. This time, it's Fu who escapes the submission. She just got her dough. There's a counter by Fu. Hitting Choo Choo with a neck breaker. With the stomp. Another stomp. And there's the elbow drop. Rolls over Choo Choo for the cover. Kick out. Knee to the back. As Fu slaps the back of the head of Choo Choo to the mat. And she's slapping at her now. Fu Cass is slapping at Choo Choo. I don't know why. He hasn't beaten her yet. Oh, now dropping her knee on the back of Choo Choo. Well, hurting both arms as well. Spinning kick. Choo Choo blocks that kick. Swips the leg of Fu. It goes for the ankle lock. Ankle lock locked in. And on Fu. Countering the submission. Oh, the kick. Come on. Two counts. Fu Cassid thought she had Choo Choo with a spinning kick. Juju hits it with the uppercut. Kicked in the section by Fu. And goes for another Venus fly trap. There's the second suplex. That's it. With a fisherman suplex. Come on. Rope break. Choo Choo's right foot saves the day. But wait a minute. Fu Cass is heading to the top rope. Timing knee drop. Close line. Now cracks the neck of Choo Choo. Cover. And the kick out. Knee to the back. Oh. Choo Choo didn't like that. That's who kicks him at section. There it is! The ah! winner is Nika! And oh! Choo Choo rolled out from the split leg drop! Full on! And going full to. Oh! Drives her back on the top ten back on. That's the power slam! Cover! And a kick out. Sending Choo Choo to the corner. Oh, got her with the elbow. And now, oh no, Choo Choo. Choo Choo's going for the submission hole. Submission hole locked in. And Fukase. And now just by the tap out. Choo Choo is your winner, ladies and gentlemen. Let's check out the highlights of this incredible matchup. We see Fu with those Venus fly traps. Choo Choo, good for the brain buster. Had her submission hole locked in. Here comes another Venus fly trap by Fu Kase. Here is your winner by submission. One half of the goddesses of column champions. Choo Choo. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Choo Choo is no doubt ready to defend the goddesses of column titles in our coming event of column.
And now we're almost getting ready for our second match of the night. But first, some few words from Bunny Club member and one third of the challenges for the Altis of Kaldum Championship, Cyan Hishirikawa. Please welcome already in the ring, Cyan Hishirikawa. Umiko want Umiko again on a former high speed champion. Ruling out a title to Rukia Kuchki. Don't tell me let me go telling Stein she is not worthy of being a part of the high speed called Bricks Tournament. Yet, Umiko with Juni Jima want Mo and Choo Choo for another shot at the goddesses of Column Championship as well. Umiko's not even scheduled for a match here tonight, but Juni Jima is. Telling Sanchez the kid playing a grown up game.
And it's Umiko Hagao who gets the last words here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. And with that said, it is time for an incredible champion versus champion versus champion match here tonight ladies and gentlemen as the high speed champion princess of fuego takes on one half of the goddesses of color champions moa and one third of the artists of Column champions hikaru fire The following contest is a three-way match set for one fall. Introducing first, representing the Bunny Club. From Japan, she is one half of the Goddesses of Column Champions, Moa. And now, introducing her opponent, representing Herons and Call Wrestling Guerrera. She is the high speed champion from Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico, Princesa Fuego. Princess of Fuego, a long red with Rose. Have a home. And that is called Wrestling Guerrero. Here come their opponent.
And now, introducing their opponent, representing MLG from Tokyo, Japan. She is one third of the Altus of Kaldom Champions, Hikaru Fire. Gentlemen, this is not for a championship. This is a non title match. The only one with a singles belt here in this three way is Princess of Fuego. All three women are ready. Here we go. There's a kick to the, to the lag by Princess of Fuego. No, with a punch. Fuego turns her over. She goes for the back suplex. He got to fire, stomping in the corner. Oh, drop kicks Princess of Fuego, but it wasn't enough to take it down. Fuego now going for the suplex on Hikaru. More kicks, Princess of Fuego. I went for the stop. Fuego with a kick to Lego More. There's the punch by Hikaru. Another punch. More punches. Oh, touched by Princess of Fuego. Went for the spinning kick. And goes for the close line. As Princess of Fuego knee drops. The right arm of Moa goes after Hikaru for the gut buster. Ever listen, Jedi Princess of Will will only be defending her high speed championship until we have a winner out of the high speed called Prince Tournament. Princess of Will, whoa, Tornado DDT. He counters on the apron. As Princess of Fuego goes with the back suplex on Noah. She saw Hikaru and brings her back in the ring with a suplex. Hikaru blocks Fuego's forearm and sets her to the corner. Got her with a forearm there. Rolls her up for a cover. Kick out. Sets is locked in, but it looks like Princess of Fuego escapes it. More turns it over. Oh, double teaming on Fuego! Double DDT! For one time only, we saw Mo and Hikaru double teaming up on someone. Hikaru now, with a one legged boxing crab on Moa. Yes, he can do fire. Over the arm drag. He kind of blocks the forearm of Moa. As well kicks the midsection of Princess of Fuego. Ooh, Fuego with the knee on Moa. He kind of with those farms and not his chops. But Princess of Fuego got him with a close line. Moa dodged there. There's the punch. Dodged by Princess of Fuego as Moa flapjacks. Princess of Fuego to the top rope, and there's the cover. Kick out. Princess of Fuego and Moa playing cat and mouse. Hikaru and Fuego, as well as Moa, back in the ring. As Hikaru goes for the DDT on Princess of Fuego. 
Another last suplex to Moa in the pin. Kick out. Moa with the uppercut. He kind of fell. Took out Princess of Fuego. Forwards by Hikaru and Moa. Moa blocks. Hits Hikaru with a forward. Oh! Ankle lock! Ankle lock by Moa! She's cut the left leg of Hikaru. But Princess of Fuego breaks up the pit. The submission hold. Oh! Takes down Moa! Kick out. She's got her up. Nightmare's jumped by Fuego. Nightmare's jumped by Moa. There's a carnival tie up. Fuego pushing it away. Cliff's line. Forearm Hikaru. Another four. Set to the top 10 buckle. But there's a counter by Hikaru. Springboard cross bodies. The referee. By mistake. As Hikaru hits the jawbreaker on Princess of Fuego. And there's the super kick. Come on! He kind of but broken up by Moa. Moa takes down Princess of Fuego and goes for the cover. Kick out. Picks her up. Got her with a kick to the mid section. Just get her up again. Moa. Wait, Fuego. Reversed it. Reversal by Moa, as he kind of hits the cap kick on Princess of Fuego. Mishinoku driver by Hikaru Fire cover. Kick out. Hikaru now going after Moa. Forearm, blocks her. Forearm by Hikaru again. Moa sends Hikaru to the barricade. No. Oh no, Moa puts Hikaru's midsection to the barricade now. Hikaru with a counter. Forearm. Elbow by Moa. And a drop kick. As Hikaru's back hits the apron. Moa elbows Princess of Whale, but she got her with a fireman's carry. Sending Moa face fist. To the apron. She's got Hikaru up and brings her back in the ring. Rolls her off with the cover. Kick out. Nice touch by Princess of Whale to Hikaru. Oh no. More with the ankle lock. Ankle lock. On Princess of Fuego in the middle of the ring. She's got nowhere to go. Finally, Hikaru breaks it up. Broke up the pin that Moa had on Princess of Fuego. And there's the elbow to lead by Hikaru. Kick to the mid section. And the catch stop. Come back. Hikaru Fire takes the win here tonight. An incredible three way match between three champions, ladies and gentlemen. There we see the last dance by Princess of Fuego and Hikaru Fire. More. With a close line to Fuego. But at the end, Hikaru Fire walks out with the win here tonight. Here is your winner. One third of the artist of Kondo Champions, Hikaru Fire. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we're about to head over to our high speed. Complex match. But first, 
Here it comes. Hello. The Lost Cars. That's its time. Wait, it's not the Lost Cars, it's the Wise Wolf. As the Wise Wolf is ready for her show. Here in column, ladies and gentlemen. It's Happy Fun Time Hollow of the Bunny Club. Maybe she's gonna talk about her teammates becoming the number one contenders for the Artist of Column Championship. Who knows? Anything can happen when Hollow is here. Please welcome, already in the ring, Hollow, the Wise Wolf! Looks like Hollow wants a guest here tonight, and it's none other than Jubia Loxer. Yeah, she comes. Folks, think Yuvia is gonna play Hollow's game? Let's find out. Well, Julio, welcome to Hollow's fun time, whole gotten for it. Telling Jimmy it's clear something's bothering her. And she should have been a woman. But she don't appreciate the interruption. And now she's got her attention. Julia telling Hollow that she's one of the best here at Cullen, but Julia's a better wrestler than her. Uh-oh. Hollow not paying attention and she fell asleep for a minute. As the fans here in Tokyo didn't come here to listen to Julia's news fest. Jubia wanting Hollow one on one here tonight. Saying she's the best wrestler in Caldum. And nobody's better in the ring than her. Huh? 
Allo doesn't understand why everything has to resort to violence. So I think Julia that she's nothing but a bully trying to push everyone around. And she's not gonna fall for it. And her answer is no to a one-on-one -on -one match. It doesn't matter where it's gonna happen, either in a normal show or at a CPB. Saying Hollow will still go down. Hollow now does any permission to kick Julia's butt. Saying that they can have a match or a fight. Reminding Hollow, she is the former World of Color champion. Former tournament winner of all call bricks. That's how she got her right to challenge for the World of Color championship, ladies and gentlemen. And now we're heading over full high speed Complex tournament matchup. Cyan Hishiri Kawa battles one third of the Altest of Kaldum champions in Umi Misu. And it's next. The following contest is a high-speed Complex match scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, representing the Bunny Club from Japan, Cyan Hishirikawa. Sun Hishiri Kawa who took hollow spot here in the high speed call pricks match. Here it comes, her opponent. And now, introducing her opponent. 
representing M L G from Yokohama, Japan. She is one third of the oldest of Kodon champions. Umi Misu. Gentlemen, here we go. Umi with a hat says S. Needs the back of sight. Oh, she didn't like that one bit. As Umi goes with the Irish whip. Forms. Cyan to the outside of the ring. And goes after her. Blocks a kick. Dragon screw left whip. Now Cyan with a DDT on Umi. Pits are up. That's the wrist lock. Oh, but Umi hits her with a forearm. Blocks her. Umi got her with the arm drag. Kick to the leg by Cyan. And goes with a super kick. Dash that super kick. Dodged by Cyan now. Kind of a tie up. Umi pushed her way. Umi blocking the forearm of Cyan. Oh, but Cyan got it with the elbow to the knee. That's the punch by Umi. Cyan kicks him with section. Wrist lock. And all forearm by Umi. Now it's chop. Saved by Cyan. But Umi sends her face first to the steel post. Cyan brought Umi back in the ring after the 13 count. Picks her up. And Irish whips her to the corner. Umi got away. Nice drop kick. Oh, over the stomp. And now Cyan. What is she up to here? Stomping the right hand of Umi Misu. Umi gets her back with a jaw breaker. Get her by Cyan. Umi blocked her over the punch. And a Navitz chop. Navitz chop by Cyan as well. And hits Umi. With, oh, got her with a knee to the head. Here it is. The Alabama Slammer. Cover. Kick out. And now West Umi go with Cyan. And Cyan elbows the bit section of Umi now. Over the form. Umi touched her. Turns her over. Form by Sign there. Pushes Umi away. Kicks the midsection. And goes for the release German suplex. Picks her up. Kick to the midsection. Velos at a bye. The neck breaker. Cover. She's got Umi measured up now. Kicks her knee for the Shining Wizard. Cover. But Umi kicks out. First we saw Fu versus Choo Choo. Then Moa versus Hikaru. Now Cyan versus Umi, oh, there's the Alabama Slammer. 
Picks her up. And Aumi. Going for the stun gun. She's got Cyan up. Sending her to the corner. Turns her over. Uh oh. I know what comes next. It's time to walk the plank, ladies and gentlemen. Umi goes to the top rope for her diving elbow drop. Who has the insane elbow cover? Cyan! Cyan kicked out! Cyan HD cover, ladies and gentlemen, who is in second place of the high speed call pricks tournament. Jawbreaker in the big boot. Picks up Umi. Snapmare. Umi got her with the elbow. This is Cyan's last match for the tournament. And scissors. And goes with a chin headlock. If Cyan wants to win the tournament, she needs this win here tonight. That Cyan elbows the bit section of Umi Misu. Kicks him at section now. As she goes for the Buckle Boom. Moving Umi and Rosa off full the cover. Kick out. Oh, Umi with a dragon screw leg whip. Picks up Cyan. Arm drag. And now Cyan putting Umi in the ropes. Irish whip. There it is. Cyan had it. Cover. A finishing maneuver. Oh, kick out. Is that a finisher or a finisher? I don't know. Just get Umi up. There it goes. Full the. Oh, countered by Umi. Northern Light Suplex cover. Kick out. He's got a fly for the inside elbow! Cover! And Umi Misu defeats Cyan Hishinikawa here tonight! Which means Cyan has been eliminated from the tournament! She cannot catch up to Ranko Kansaki. Cyan ends her high speed car bricks with a total of four points. Well, Ranko has six points. Here is your winner, one third of the oldest of Kaldom champions, Umi Misu. And with that said, ladies and gentlemen, we are now heading over to your fourth match of the night. In just a few hours, because fast. We've got to interview someone here tonight. Or they got to say here. They got to say something here tonight as well. But who will it be? It's none other than Hifumi Takimoto of MLG.
please welcome already in the ring Hifumi Takimoto Here comes the boar, Kagura. <laughs> Former Altis of Kaldum champion, ladies and gentlemen.
And he who be Takimoto gets the last words here tonight. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we are closing the night with three, six women's tag team matches. First up. What? Not three? Is it three? Yes, it is three, six women's tag team matches. First up, he runs alongside Juvia Loxa. Take on the Bunny Club. And it's next. The following contest is set for one fall and it is a six women's tag team match introducing first representing heroines from Magnolia, Levy McGarden and Kana Alberona. Here come the tag team partner, ladies and gentlemen. And now, introducing their tag team partner from Russia, now reciting in California, also wrestling for OCBF, Juvia Law. 
There she is, ladies and gentlemen, Juvia Loxil, former World of Cardom champion. Winner of all goddesses of Cardom Carl Bricks. She first won that tournament to get a shot at the World of Cardom title and walked away as champion. Also fought for the wonder of Cullen Championship, which her former friend, Hall of the Lost Cause, was holding. In her last match at Cullen, when she left for GLL. Well, she left GLL with a World of Cullen Championship, not the wonder of Cullen Championship. Came back challenging Rito Tsukimi to unify the titles. Since Rito was again World of Column champion. Here come their opponents. Now, introducing their opponents, representing the Bunny Club. First, making her way to the ring. From Japan, Invis Toka. Toka, ladies and gentlemen, a former future column champion. Is ready for this six women's tag team match here tonight. Here comes her tag team partner. And now, introducing her tag team partner. From Turkey. Now reciting in California. Hollow the Lost Cause How the Lost Cause finally gave herself a shot at the Artist of Column Championship. I don't know if she had an earlier title shot with three other 
teammates, not three other teammates, two other teammates. But in all history, Hollow has not been our as a column champion yet. the leader of the body club Rito Tsukimi and now introducing their tag team partner from Japan she is the commissioner of World Divine Ring Column leader of the body club Rito Tsukimi Both Rito Tsukimi and Hollow, the last cast of former Wonder of Column champions Only two Bunny Club members have won that title. One Heroines has won it. Well, technically two Heroines has won it. A former Skull Maidens member won it as well. And now currently the one of the Club champion is the leader of our new faction here called them Rukia Kuchki. But now anyways, back to the match. As the Levy Mag Garden gets sent to the corner by Invest Toka. Togo, Hammerlock. DDT! Hammerlock DD. Reverse DDT to be exact. As she stumps the arm of the Levy. Stumps the knee. Vector up. Thorar. Oh! One arm DDT there. Spinning kick by Ms. Togo on Levy. As Levy kicks him in section. Over the running knee strike. And a kick to the chest. Togo with the arm drag. Going for another one arm DDT. This time, has the arm ball locked in. And stumps. The back of the levy back good and stumps it off now. Picks her up. Goes for the Irish whip to the corner. Levy got away. Strong Irish whips took it over the top rope. Attacks in Juvia locks it. There's the punch by Toka. Julia blocks her. Going for the knee. Julia locks her going against two former teammates. Well, they were known as the Black Dragons. Here, call them. Former teammates of Julia include Inves Toka, Hollow the Lost Cost, and Hifumi Takimoto. Now, all map maps have got their separate ways. There goes Togo with a fireman's carry. Elbows the knee of Juvia. And no. Uh, wrist lock. That's a punch to the midsection by Juvia Luxa. As Togo hits him with a fireman's carry. Luxa punch. Kick in the midsection of Toka. Reversed by Toka as she kicks the leg of Juvia. That's Jimmy counters Toka. Trying to bring her back in the ring. Referee's at the 12 count. Oh, sends Toka to the steel steps. 13 count. Toka gets back in the ring. And so does Jubia. 
She's got Jiri in the corner. Punched her back. Putting Jiri in the corner again. But Jiri counters. There's the elbow by Toka. Jubia with a kick to the leg. Wrist lock into the hammer lock. But there's the elbow by Toka. Hammer lock. Oh. Reverse by Jubia into a reverse DDT. Stopping Toka. Oh no. Here we go. Black mass. Cover. Hollow in the ring. Breaks up the pin. As Levy sends all over the top rope. Jimmy now interacting with the crowd here in Tokyo. On the middle rope. The top right corner. Countered by Toka. Went for the drop kick. Moves Jubia. And tags in Hollow the Lost Cause. Here we go, Hollow Julia once again, ladies and gentlemen. Hollow with the Irish whip. Just this elbow. Picks her up. Thank you for the Archant Hand. Backbreaker into the face buster. Julia and I know she's gonna rake her eye Julia with a counter there we go dragon suplex tax in Levy Matt Gordon oh Levy with the knee to the head that's the knee strike kicks the chest of hollow An Irish whip set to the corner. Running knee to the midsection. And the alley oop. Kicks that chest of hollow again. Wibble punch. And a reverse exploder. Kick out. We chose a butt hollow. Counter it. Would have dropped to a hole. Fisherman Brino Busta. Hollow's mashing her up. Four. Die! Fairy tale ending! <laughs> Levy kicks out! <laughs> Hollow's got her submission hold! Hollow! Hollow has it! Rings of Saturn! But Levy! Escaping the submission hold of Hollow. As Levy Irish whips Hollow to the corner. Hollow taking out Connell Barona. What? Here comes Jubia now. Hollow with those scores of her knocking down Jubia locks her. Decides to go after Jubia now. And she's mashing her up. Kicks a bit section for a fairy tale ending. <laughs> Moving Juvia far away from a tag team partners for the cover. Juvia kicked out. And there's a tag to Rito Tsukimi. As Rito cracks the neck of Julia Luxa. Julia now gets Rito with a jawbreaker. 
forearm. Sending Rito to the corner. And tacks in Levy McGarden. Irish whip. Atomic drop. And a big boot by Juvia. Assistant by Levy. Dragon Slayer. Dragon Slayer locked in by Levy McGarden. As Rito escapes the submission. Levy's got her down. Dragon screw leg whip. Counter by Rito. Swinging neck breaker. Picks up Levy. And sends her to the other corner. Took her down with a close line. There's the stomp. Rito. With the Rito's cutter! She's got Levy up! And she's going for the Seaclags! Maltolo stops it by Rito, so Kimi Levy rolls out the ring. Rito gonna fly! Timing! Elbow! Was that a timing double axe handle? As Rito's sending Levy face fast to the apron. And brings her back in the ring. Guess with the elbow. Who wants in? It's Jimmy Aloxa who gets the tag. Big boot to Rito. But Rito blocks her forearm. Oh no. Rito's caught her for a diamond. Death. Drop. Can't Jimmy get out of it. Rito goes for the cover. Connor. Connor Morono with the save. Check this out. Arm drag solo. Jimmy counters Rito. Picks her up. As Rito hits Jimmy with a forearm. Jimmy kicks her midsection. Brain Buster! You know, the release German suplex as Jimmy is gonna set up in the left corner. Running knee! She's got the hand of Rito and kicks her arm. Kicks the Met section. Fellow by. Oh. Buckle bomb. She's measuring her up now. The STF. No! It's not the STF! It's Jimmy's submission hold! The finisher! Rito hanging off on the alive! And the referee says no tap out! As Rito knees the head and elbows the head of Juvia! Rito with the Irish whip! Juvia hangs on the rope! As Rito goes to attack in hollow, the lost cause! Jimmy up back in the ring, sending Hollow to the corner. Counter by Hollow, touched by Jimmy. Pop up, Godbuster! Jimmy has Hollow in the corner. Tagged in Levy McGordon. Suplex with the assist by Levy with a dubbing maneuver. On. Picks her up. Carnival tie up. Hollow pushed away. 
Delta will DDT. Hello, go for the Alpha. He's gonna escape the submission. Punching away on the head of Hulu. Hulu escapes Levy. Go for the punch. And that's with the back breaker. Levy rolled out the way. She's got Hulu now. Push there. Hulu with a kick to the right section. And the fisherman bring the buster. Slurvy stomps the arm. She's got her up. Hollow kicks that section of Levy. But Levy goes with the back suplex. And now, oh, Hollow blocks her. Forearm. Irish whip by Levy to the corner. Hollow counters. Puts Levy on the top turn buckle. That's the punch. As Hollow goes for the super blocks to the outside of the ring. And yes, ladies and gentlemen, this is awesome. Hollow with the elbow. Levy blocks her chop. And goes for the oh! Hello, elbow still head of Levy. The break oh no! Swinging face buster. That's the tag to Connell Barona. Blocks her chop. Get her with the forearm in the close line. Hoods caught on the ropes. Irish whip. Step jamming suplex. Roll up by Polo. Kick out. Picks up Connor. Almost strikes. Connor fights back. Get her by Hollow. There's the punch. Springboard. Oh, nobody was there. Hollow. That's kind of a little strong Irish whip to the corner. Stones Hollow. Tents her over. Hurting the leg of Hollow. The last cost. But Hollow hits him with a jawbreaker. Got the disarmament on Conal Barona. 
Kona hanging on. Kona escapes his submission. Rito punches Kona's back. Come on, ref. There's the elbow by Kona. Sending Toga to the other corner. Sends her back to the corner. Throws Toga to the outside of the ring. As Kana's going for her. Torpedo DDT. Toga blocks Kana's four. Cover by Kana. Toga pushes Kana away. As Kana gets with a dragon screw left whip. Counter there by Toka. Blocked by Kana with the close line. There's Toka with the arm drag. And now, check this out right here. Bam! Planting down Kana. Oh, now protective matting. Kana kicks the leg of Toka. Toka pushed there. Warren blocked by Kana. She brings Toka back in the ring. Tension over. Toka got her with a boot. And a calf kick. There's the jawbreaker by Kana. Sending Toka to the corner. As Toka pushes her away, Kana sends her to the other corner. Counter by Toka again, sending Kana to the other corner. Not nice jump, not nice jump by Kana as well. There's the punch by Toka. Wrist lock, four by Kana. Toka kicks in that section. This armor, this armor is locked down by Toka. And Kana taps out. Hitman's Toka has made Kana El Barona submit, ladies and gentlemen. In this incredible six women's tag team match. Here are your winners, by submission, Hollow, The Lost Cost, Rito Tsukimi, and Invest Toka, The Bunny Club. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we're almost heading to your co-main event of the evening. But first, some viewers... So Wait a minute! Who is this? It's Rukia Catch K! The one of column champion has arrived to our evening show.
Please welcome, already in the ring, your Wonder of Kaldum champion, Rukia Kuchki! Here comes the World of Golem Champion, Kathy! These two champions are gonna go at it at all main event, ladies and gentlemen.
and Ruki had it off of Kati and slaps her. Kati going with a back suplex. There's the stomp. Close lining Kati now. Both ladies back in the ring. Kathy outside the ring now. Ruki went out there. Oh, there's the kick. And then that's heel by Kathy. As Ruki with a dragon screw leg whip. Kathy blocks her kick. Going for a dragon screw leg whip as well. Went for the belt. Kathy. With a punch. Puts Rookie on the corner. There he goes. To sit her on the top barricade. There's the back boot. Rookie blocks her kick. Kathy with the arch to the corner. Rookie got away. There's the stump. She puts Kathy on the top rope and throws her down. Close long. And the referee separates Rukia Kushki from Kathy. But goodness, ladies and gentlemen, this main event is just getting more interesting if I do say so myself. But now, it is time for the cone main event of the evening. As he ruins battle M L G Curry Girl, Kagura Buddha and Miss Japan take on Juni Jima, Hifumi Takimoto, and Aoba Suzukaze. And did I mention it's next? The following contest is set for one fall and it is a six women's tag team match. It is in first representing heroines making her way to the ring from Tokyo Japan. She's hot. She's spicy. She makes everything taste great. Curry girl.
And now introducing her tag team partner from Tokyo, Japan, Kagura Buta. And now, introducing their tag team partner from Tokyo, Japan, leader of heroines, Misu Japan. And now, introducing their opponents from Tokyo, Japan, Hifumi Takimoto, Jun Ijima, and Aoba Susukaze. They are M. L. G. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. It's the start of the co-main event. With Curry Girl taking on Juni Jima. Both former Future of Column champions. Oh, what a form by Jun knocking down Curry Girl to the outside of the ring. The referee starting to count out. Kagura with the assist on Curry Girl, punching the back of Juni Jima. June punching the mid section of Kagura. Kagura blocks it for Curry Girl's got June now. Nope, bombs into Kagura. Kagura throwing down June and I'll protect the matting. June blocks, blocked by Curry Girl, as June went for the arm drag. Then Curry Girl to the steel steps. As Curry Girl kicks the midsection of June, blocks her forearm, one broke forearm of her own. But June sets Curry Girl to the steel steps. Curry Girl blocks her, blocked by June. Curry Girl with a fireman's carry. 
There's the kick to the midsection by June and gets back in the ring. Now wait. Curry Girl trying to bring June back in the ring by Kate. As June punches the back of Curry Girl and brings her back in the ring. Over the stomp. Leg drop. Double stops to the head of Curry Girl and a knee to the back. Here comes Curry Girl with the suplex. Moves Judy Jima and tags in Mizu Japan. Jima with a jaw breaker. Here comes Mizu Japan with the elbows to the mid section. Now that's Chop. June with the arch to the corner. Uh oh. Check this out. Sunset flip bomb into the pin. Kick out. And that's attack to Hifumi Takimoto. Here for me, elbows the midsection of Mr. Japan and goes for the close line. Next, the uppercut by Mr. Japan. And a snap suplex as well. Kick to midsection by Here for me. Mr. Japan kicks her midsection. Denies her calf kick. Top rope, close line. By Miss Takimoto. Thing Mizu Japan to the corner. She got away. It would be with a reversal. Sending Mizu Japan back to the corner. But Mizu Japan goes outside the ring. Ah, oh, uses the top rope to advantage. It would be with the elbow. Kick to Mizu Japan by Mizu Japan and a Nodo Light Suplex. Japan stopping the arm of him for me. Here for me with the Irish whip. Mrs. Japan hangs on the rope. Oh no, what's here for me gonna do here? An apron DDT. And sends Mrs. Japan to the steel barricade. Her head to the barricade as well. Counter by Mizu Japan. Counter by Kifumi. Mizu Japan punched her back. Sending Kifumi back in the ring. Has her in the corner. Counter by Mizu Japan. Sending Kifumi to the other corner. Throws her down. Bulda split leg and moonsault. Cover. Kick out. Knee to the back. Here comes hip of me. With the good. Ah. TKO slap. Fireman's carry slap. On ball. On ball locked in by Hibami Tungiboto. It looks like this is Japan. He's gonna punch the head of Hibami to escape. Got sent to the corner by Hibami. There's the attack to Juni Jima. Double large whip. Double head throw. in Japan, measuring up Juni Jima hip attack cover Alba Suzukasa was distracting the referee one two as Juni Jima had enough time to kick out thanks to that distraction by Alba 
Miss of Japan going to tag in Curry Girl. And there's the long drag by Juni Jima. Curry Girl sends her to the corner. Sends her over. Slipping her head. Head past the top 10 buckle multiple times. June sends Curry Girl to the corner now. Monkey flip. Picks her up. Sends Curry Girl to the corner. MLG dominating this match so far. Middle rope double center back here for me, Takimoto. Snap suplex. That's the stop. And Curry Girl turns it into a reverse DDT. Here comes the elbow drop. As Curry Girl's going for the arm of here for me. Turning her over. And sending here for me to the other corner. Punch. Counter by here for me. There's the old by Curry Girl. Uranagi! Come on. Kick out. And a knee to the back. Curry Girl measures her up now. Wait. She instead puts here for me on the ropes. But he will be, he will be counters. Punching Curry Girl to the outside of the ring. But it's Curry Girl who brings him with me in the ring. Oh no! The calf crusher! The calf crusher! But he will be talking out now. Can Curry Girl hang on? Looks like she does this. Here for me, let go of the calf crusher. There's a tag to Juni Jima. Oh, but Curry Girl kicks her knee and close like her to the corner. Filled by the knee strike. June's back up. Dodging the close line of June. June dodges as well. Goes for the. Oh, alley you face busted by Curry Girl. Irish whips June to the corner. Went for the hip attack. Double axe and door. And here's the Uri Nagi. Cover. All but takes out the referee. Forearms. Kagura. Both women heading back to the corner. There's the job breaker by Juni Jima. And an STO. Stops the back of Curry Girl. Curry Girl hurting the right arm of June. June goes with the Irish whip. Blocked her elbow. It's an elbow tie up. June pushes Curry Girl away. And she caught her full. Her submission hold. Juni Jima submission finishers locked in. Curry Girl hanging off of the line once again and she survives it. June with a kick to the section, followed by the count breaker. Cover. But there's Miss Japan to break up the pin. Tackled by Curry Girl. Went for the stomp. Another stomp. Goes for the arch to the corner. Counter by June. And there's the back breaker. There's the jaw breaker by Curry Girl. Oh, air 
Superboy spin into a TKO. Close line by Judy Jima. Next attack to Kagura Buta. Jun kicks the leg of Kagura. Sends her to the corner. Judy Jima going for the hat says ass. Tagging in here for me, Takimoto. Oh, but ran into that boot of Kagura. Hello's line. Hifumi kicks her leg. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hifumi going for her Takimoto clash. Come on. Kick out. by Kagura. Archery by here for me. Oh! That assist by Oba sends Kagura over the top rope. And Kagura showing no remorse to Oba taking her down. Hifumi's got her. But Kagura turns it into a rope. To a DDT. DDT by Kagura. Kagura kicking the leg of Owa, but she got her with the elbow. Kagura fights back with a clothesline. Here we now with a forearm. Here's the punch by Kagura. Owa punches Kagura. Kagura hits Owa with a clothesline. Kagura. Oh, here we kicks her leg. Kagura Buddha's getting double teamed by Alba Suzukaz and Hifumi Takimoto. That's the block by Hifumi, discus strike. And that's jump by Kagura. Hifumi kicks her leg. Kagura blocks her forearm. Arm drag by Hifumi. And look at Alba go. Picks her up. But Kagura brought Alba back in the ring. takes out Juni Jima and there's the giant suplex by Hifumi Irish whips Kagura to the corner she got away Hifumi with the Irish whip Kagura hangs on the rope punched by Hifumi and goes for an apron back suplex Sending Kagura back in the ring. And now Hifumi is going for the calf crusher. Rope break. Hifumi from the middle rope. What is she going to do? There for the diving elbow drop. Kagura's got her up. Sitting here for me over the top rope and tags in Curry Girl. Curry Girl breaks. Oh, tries to bring him me back in the ring. Him for me now with a reverse DDT. Hifumi brought Curry Girl back in the ring, but Kagura hits Hifumi with a backbreaker stretch. Hifumi's almost out of it. Can she make it back in time in the ring? Or MLG? Will lose via count out? Oh no, Curry Girl broke the count out. Referee starting all over again. A shoulder tackle by Hifumi. Very good with the punch. Hifumi with a punch as well. Discus strike. Nice nice job by Curry Girl. And Curry Girl goes down. Six. 
picks her up. Miss Japan hitting Hifumi with the head scissors. Kirigo with a knee drop. Hifumi counters. There's a counter by Curry Girl. Referees at the 10th count. Curry Girl kicks the midsection of Hifumi. Hifumi blocks her. There it goes. Full uh, uh, back breaker. Swing and neck breaker by Hifumi Takimoto now. And sends Curry Girl back in the ring. Curry Girl sending Hifumi to the corner. She got away. And now Hifumi, she's got Curry Girl for the power bomb. Curry Girl gets over the job breaker. The pop up fireball punch. Come on. Alba breaks it up. Mr. Japan mistook Curry Girl for Alba and hit her with a bulldog. Curry Girl tags her in. Mr. Japan, oh, there's the uppercut by Hifumi. Kicks them in section of Mr. Japan. And goes for the pop handle. Good buster. Hifumi with a running knee drop. And up, she's getting distracted by Kagura Buddha. Kagura hits him with a forearm. This is Japan with a jaw breaker. Sends Miss Japan to the corner. She got away. This is Japan, sent to the other corner by Hifumi Takimoto. Oh wait, what's gonna happen right here? Oh, took too long as Hifumi elbows her bed section. Wrist lock. Forearm by Miss Japan. Has Hifumi in the corner. Turns her over. Here it is! Mr. Japan split like a moon salt! But Hifumi gets it with a jaw breaker! In a 19-16! Hifumi setting up in the apron now! For her! Phenomenal forearm! Cover. Curry Girl breaks it up. Bates Buster by June on Curry Girl. And Hifumi tacks in Alba Suzu Kaze. Alba with the Irish to the corner. Hip attack. Over the stop. What a close line by Misu Japan. What an insane co-main event. This is turning out Fox. Knee strike by Alba Suzukaze. Blocks it. Forearm. Irish whips Alba to the corner. Drop kick denied. And a springboard. Drop kick. Oh, Calvert as well. Missing Japan. There it is. Feel the sun. Locked in! Alba hanging off of the alive! Leading the head of Miss Japan now! As she gets flapjack to the top rope by Miss Japan! Alba now with the uppercut! Sends Miss Japan over the top rope. And then 
Chris. Oh, this is Japan. Dutch dirt super kick. Elbow kicks her leg. Elbows the knee. Counter by Miss of Japan. Elbow kicks her midsection. Counter by Miss of Japan now. And brings Elba back in the ring. Elba goes after her. New test press by Misu Japan. Picks her up. Bringing Elba back in the ring. And now, Elba! Will Rinagi! Are over. There's the counter by Miss in Japan. Sending Elba to the corner. Counter by Elba. Now it's chops by both women. Just got Elba in the corner. Got her with the boot. She sends Miss in Japan to the other corner. Hip attack. And now, the running knee strike. Judy Chima with a head says that's on Kagura Buta. Alba measuring up Kagura Buta. I don't know why. Curry Girl was tacked in by Mr. Japan. Famasu! By Alba and Curry Girl. Kind of will tie up. Curry Girl pushed away. Close line. Picks her up. But Elba got her with a close line. Curry Girl sends Elba to the corner. Hip attack. Shoulders of Hibumi Takimoto. My goodness, ladies and gentlemen, this is an insane six women's tag team match here tonight. As Elba goes for the DDT. Goes after Curry Girl. Got her with the elbow. Dodged their kick. Miss Japan going for the hat scissors. And Elba Suzukaze. Sending Curry Girl to the steel steps as Mr. Japan hits Alba with a bulldog. Curry girl with the air 
playing spin. TKO! And out, just setting up for the carried fireball punch. Come on. She walks out with the win here tonight, ladies and gentlemen, in this insane co-main event, six women's tag team match. Kagura, Buta, Misu, Japan, and Curry Girl, he ruins. By goodness, ladies and gentlemen, these six women let me with no voice at all. That was one hack of a battle. And with that said, ladies and gentlemen, we are almost ready for your main event of the evening. But first, some few words from Aoba Suzukaze. Please welcome back in the ring, leader of MLG, Alba Suzukaze. Suzukaze who just got pinned by Curry Girl, ladies and gentlemen.
right, ladies and gentlemen, those were the words from Alba Susu Kaze. That is time to close the show with this incredible six women's tag team match. As the faction known as Lasses of the World Battle Skull Maidens. We've got many Mira Jane Strauss and Rukia Kushki taking on Roxanne, the CWA World Champion Igniting Kid, and the World of Column Champion Kathy. Also, we got, ladies and gentlemen, that Rukia Kushki is your Wonder of Column Champion. The following contest is your main event and it is a six women's tag team match set for one fall. It is in first, Mira Jane Strauss, Mini and the wonder of Kai No. E.G. Mako! Now, introducing their opponents. First, making their way to the ring. From the United States of America, Roxanne and the World of Column Champion, Kathy. Gold Maidens!
And now, introducing their tag team partner, also representing Skull Maidens from Copenhagen, Denmark. She is the CWA World Champion Igniting Kid. And uh, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Last show of day three of Caldum New Year's Heroes. Roxanne Mini fighting it out here tonight. Ooh, what a drop kick there. Both women, former high speed champions. I bet you they'll put one heck of a fight here tonight. Mini went for the monkey flip. Oh! Roxanne blocked her spinning kick. And there's the snap suplex. And Mini now with the snap suplex. Countered by Roxanne. with a forearm. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, when we had two champions versus champions matches. Well, the second was a three-way champion match. Right now, we have the wonder of column champion against the world of column champion in that six women's tag team match. Ready now, going for another monkey flip. Well, we can't. This include though, see the way world champion as well in igniting kid. Really taking out Roxanne with that shoulder tackle. Roxanne blocks it. Snap suplex. Mini kicks her midsection. Roxanne blocks her four. Blocked by Mini. Counter by Roxanne. Mini blocks her forearm. Counter by Roxanne again. Mini with the block to the kick. Again, these two going at it. Revessel after Revessel. Finally, Roxanne went down. So Roxanne kicks the midsection of Mini. Mini with a spinning kick. Roxanne sent her to the steel steps. Mini blocks the forearm, countered by Roxanne. There's a kick to the midsection by Roxanne now. And punches the head of Mini. Mini punching the head of Roxanne. Here comes Roxanne. Oh, here comes Mini. Here comes Roxanne. Here comes Mini. Next Mini gets back in the ring. So does Roxanne. Roxanne now with a neck breaker. She's got her up. There it goes. Oh, Mini pushing the head of Roxanne to escape. Her power bomb kicks the midsection. Standing Spanish fly. Over the stomp. And another standing Spanish fly by Mini. Hits Roxanne with a snap suplex. Mini gets back in the ring. And tags in the leader of a faction, Ruki Akuchki, your Wonder of Color champion. Oh, Roxanne with the counter. Stomping away on Rukia. And oh, Gus with a swinging neck breaker. 
Knee to the back. Going for the stop. Stops the back of Rukia. And goes for the step chairman. Suplex. Stopping the head of Rukia. Moves. Nope. Let her stay there. That's Roxanne. Is on the apron. She wants Rukia up. Here we go. Neckbreaker. Snap German suplex as well by Roxanne. Stopping the back of Rukia. There's the knee drop. Tagging in. Igniting kid. You'll see the WA World Champion. Swing heel kick. Denied by Rukia. Oh, there's the pin. And the kick out. Stops igniting kid. Moves there. And stops the head. Igniting kid now with a job breaker. Close line. There goes the Irish whip to the corner. Spear. Stomping away on the chest of Rukia now. Picks her up. Imperil DDT. Choking the heck out of Rukia. Igniting kid, igniting kid, going for her spear, cover, Mini breaks it up, uh oh, she went back to her corner, Kathy almost caught Mini there, as igniting kid gives with a modified ankle lock, that lock applied, Rookie now with a headlock of her own. Sending Igniting Kid to the corner. Sends her to the other corner. Kicks her mid section and starts choking the heck out of Igniting Kid. There's the attack to Mira Jane Strauss. Jane with the Irish whip sitting igniting kid over the top rope. There's the attack to Rukia Kuchki. Igniting kid back in the ring. Rukia Irish whip set to the corner. She got away. Sends Rukia to the other corner. Rukia got her with a boot. Sending Igniting Kid to the other corner. Forearm. Oh, the headbutt. The headbutt of Rukia Kuchki. Followed by the elbow drop. And now. Goes for the butterfly suplex. Moves Igniting Kid. And on now, and now Rukia going on her, the arms of Igniting Kid now. Picks her up. Sends her to the corner. Tents her over. Full the Karakuna kick. Cover. Igniting Kid kicks out. Out. And there's the tag to Mini. The United Kid going for the knee. Right on Mini's head. Sending Mini to the corner. Tagging in Roxanne. Double Irish whip. 
double clotheslines. I thought Roxanne was going to go for a standing moonsault, but it was a taunt. Midi now with a jaw breaker. Countered by Roxanne. And there's the head scissors. Roxanne going to go fly. She's going to fly. For the old 450, Midi got her knees up to counter. She sends Roxanne to the other corner. But she got away. Mean though, sends Roxanne to the other corner. Roxanne with a boot. Sending Mini to the other corner. Mini counters. Six. Oh no, Roxanne got it with the elbow. And there's a fireman's carry by Mini. Forum by Roxanne. Iron twist Mini to the Kona. Mini got it with a boot. Wrist lock. Forum by Roxanne. Mini with the arch whip. Roxanne hangs on the top rope. Hitting Mini with a forearm. Just got Mini in the corner. Mini with a knee. Strike on the midsection. And a, oh, Roxanne turns it into a bulldog. And next attack to the World of Column champion, Kathy. Stops Mini. And now she's gonna bite her fingers. Picks her up. Mini with the arm drag. And throws Kathy over the top rope. There's the stomp. And now Minnie's gonna bring Kathy back in the ring. Sling blade! By Minnie! For the springboard elbow drop! I don't know why Minnie didn't win for the pin. So instead, oh, that's why! Mini Driver! Come back! Can't they get out? Can't they now with a jawbreaker? Mini blocks her kick. Close nine. And now Mini go for the standing Spanish fly. What's next? Oh, a stomp by Mini. Stomps Kathy again. Tag was made of Mary Jane Strauss. Spinning kick. Wrist lock. Forum by Kathy. And close lights Mary Jane over the top rope. Mary Jane now. Going full. Oh, Kathy turns it into a reverse DDT. Picks up Mary Jane. That's the punch. Forearm. And a butterfly suplex. Kathy with the forearm. A punch. And secure the night by Mary Jane. Kathy blocks her kick and kicks the leg. Arm drag by Mary Jane. Blocks her forearm. There's the punch by Mary Jane. Now that's chop. Now that's chop by Kathy. And a snap suplex. Oh, it was countered by Mary Jane. And now she's gonna bring Kathy back in the ring. Went for the punch. And a big boot. Stopping the back of Kathy, slamming her back of the head to the mat multiple times. Picks her up. There it is. Demon Page Turner. She's got Kathy where she wants her. For the Demon Rampage. No, Kathy counters with the knee. 
And hits Mirajin with a DDT. Kathy now kicks the nice section of Mirajin and goes for an axe plex. Come back. Mirajin kicks out. Into the back by Kathy. Measures her up. Kills full die bitter and cover. Another kick out by Mary Jane. Mary Jane takes out Kathy. Moves it. And she's gonna tag in Mini. Formed by Kathy and Mini Dutch Terry and Sagiri. Formed by Kathy again. Gets with the back breaker. Mini outside the ring. Gets back in the ring. Formed by Kathy. Mini blocks the kick. Arm drag. Went for the stomp. And she's gonna tag in Mary Jane Strauss. Kathy though with the arm swept to the corner. There's the boot by Mary Jane. Elbow by Kathy. Forearm. Oh, she just stumped Rukia. Mary Jane back in the ring. Super kick. Here comes Kathy with a shoulder tackle. She's got Mary Jane all set up now. Forward. Die bitter and rolls her up full of cover. Marriage still kicked out. Unbelievable. And there's the attack to Roxanne by Katy. Rukia. Trying to assist Mirachin finally goes back to a corner as Mirachin hitting Roxanne with a middle rope. Neckbreaker. That's the stop. Roxanne outside the ring. Mirachin goes after her. Forearm. Roxanne turns it into a reverse DDT. There's the elbow by Mirachin. Roxanne elbows her knee. Elbow by Mary Jane again. Drop kick. Picks her up. Sending Roxanne back in the ring. Roxanne goes after her. Kick servant section. And now, Mary Jane pushed away. Hurricane Rona. Picks her up. There's the corner will tie up. Roxanne pushes Mary Jane. Hits her with a forearm. Mary Jane blocks that forearm. Counter by Roxanne. Mary Jane with a kick. Roxanne dodges her. Dodged by Mary Jane as well. Sending Roxanne back in the ring. And now the reverse DDT by Mary Jane moves Roxanne. Stomps her arm. Uh oh. Submission locked dead. Submission locked in by Mary Jane. But looks like Roxanne is going to escape it. That's the punch by Mary Jane. Roxanne kicks him at section. What a counter by Mary Jane. Roxanne's got her. Sit up, power ball. Oh, there's the tag to Mini. Mini with a close line. Close line. Roxanne dodges that close line and goes for the swinging tag breaker. Picks her up. Sending Mini to the corner. 
got away from her drop kick. Roxanne sending Mini to the other corner. Mini reversed it. Gives for a snap suplex, but Roxanne knees her head. Sending Mini to the other corner. Now has her in the top 10 buckle. Roxanne wants to finish the match. We have Super Spanish Fly. No pin yet. Instead, stomps the leg of Mini. Goes with the reverse DDT. Watch out. Watch out by Rukia Kushki. Too late. Roxanne was thinking of ball 50. As Mini hurts the left leg of Roxanne and measures her up. As Mini goes for the Mini Driver. Moves Roxanne far away from her teammates. And goes for the cover. With the assist of Mary Jane Strauss, Mini gets the win for Sekaino Ichimeko. What a main event, ladies and gentlemen. What a main event. Check out the highlights of this incredible match, ladies and gentlemen. Here are your winners. Mira Jane Strauss, the wonder of column champion, Rukia Kushki, and Mini Sekai no Ichimeko. Well, ladies and gentlemen, after witnessing another incredible six women's tag team match here tonight. This has been your commentator, Eddie Moulton, saying thank you all for watching. Call them New Year's Heroines, Day 3, Evening Show. And I cannot wait to see you all back for the next club event. There will be February the 15th. Yes, we will have Noodles last match in Caldom as she faces the Caldom roster but until then it is time to say these few words for now peace out and a good night from all of us here at World Divine Ring Caldom until next time